Hi, Lydia. Hi. Are you a pretty girl? Oh, you are. I know. So today, I'm going to put the soil in my alt farm over there. Lydia, do you want to help? Olivia, do you want to help me? Do you want to garden? Yeah? I take that as a yes. <laughs> so here we are. I'm out in the dome, and today's the big day. I'm going to fill my Alta farm. I don't know if you can see it back there. I have one of the trays right here in front of me and we're going to fill it with some awesome soil to get growing. So I'm going to put the camera down here so you can see what's going on and fingers crossed because this is going to be fun. It's going to work. I just know it because you guys are going to help me, right? All right, here we go. So here is the top tray um, or growing dish, whatever you want to call it. And it's kind of cool. It comes with this fancy little doodad, which is kind of intimidating to me. But once I read the quick, easy little directions, it's pretty cool how this thing works. And then there's a tray down in here. So the water's going to be down in here, obviously. And these just go right in here. And as the roots grow, they're gonna get the water from there. So this guy, I wanna make sure that it's positioned nice and good right there. Nice and tight, not tight, it's just well positioned and kinda of locked in there. So now we're ready to put the soil in. Okay, so here it is. I got the top tray filled, nice and full, and it's gonna go back there on the shelf. That's it. It just sits right up there on the shelf. Now the fun part, trying to figure out what seeds to grow in here. Now obviously I'm in zone 5B, and yes, I'm in this really cool growing environment here in the dome, but <laughs> it doesn't work miracles. <laughs> it is January and even though the sun will start, um, you know, it's coming, getting higher and therefore the dome will heat up a little more as we head into the next weeks here. I still can't grow tomatoes yet. So what we're going to do is do a little research and I'm hoping you guys will comment and let me know what you think would be the get best vegetables or best, best seeds to start growing back in these trays. So keep in mind, the dome gets down to about 42 at night um, while it's still, you know, 10 degrees or negative outdoors. So that's still a bonus, right? <laughs> okay, so we got the soil in the top bunk, we'll call it. <laughs> Olivia is anxious. She wants to get gardening. So we need your help. Can you let us know what seeds you think we should start in the Alta Farm there? So weigh in, post your comments here, and let us know. What do you think? In the meantime, I'll share a few in a few, In the meantime, I'll share with you a few important things about the dome. Because even though it's a really cool growing space, we can't grow everything in here yet. <laughs> it's Ohio. And it's January. You're in the picture. Would you like to tell everybody what you think? What do you think? What do you think? She thinks we're done and it's time to go get a treat. Right? Right, Olivia? <laughs> I'm gonna go ahead and finish filling the rest of the trays there. So I'm probably going to start with some of my all-time favorite seeds that I know will do well, like lettuces, and arugula, bok choy, kale, lettuce, and of course radishes. There we go. The four trays are filled with soil and we're ready to grow. Here is the south wall and all the way on the other side on the north is where the Alta Farm is positioned. 
and I hope to hear from you soon. Hurry up, we gotta get growing. It's January.